All right, here we go. I'm going to pour my mold. I got some fish today. There's a copper uh, rock fish, little tiny guy. And I got caught a little sand dab. So they're, you know, halfway embedded, or this guy is anyway, in the plaster. This guy is, you know, pretty much just floating on top. But I filled some little spots where the fin got sunk in, which sucks. It's really hard to get those fins spread out and not pushed under the uh, plaster. So when I second mold it, when I make a mold of this out of plaster again, then I'm going to hand carve those and, and touch those up, clean some areas up. And um, anyway, so here is the stuff. I don't really professionally mix it, so there's little air bubbles, which sucks. But So here's the stuff. And I just pour it in. I already I put sprayed the mold release on. Of course, it just soaks in the plaster, and so that'll leave a little layer of plaster. But um, at least it comes off the fish. Dang, I hope I got enough. There's that one. This guy has his mouth open a little, so it's going to go inside and have a little blob of stuff I need to cut off. Some of the scales came off when I was cleaning them. The little scales started rubbing off. Real pain in the ass. So there's some funny little spots. But once it's painted and stuff, I think it'll be okay. Whoops. Cool. Now I wasted all that. Bummer. So here's one I pulled out of the mold I did yesterday. It was like a little funny the little bottom fish. Like the little gupper, scupper fish, whatever. And you can see this is the plaster residue. So what I'll do is make a frame for it, frame it up, pour it in Plaster Paris, pop it out, trim it up, and I can trim it to the size I want, get out the imperfections, and then do this again, and do a second mold, and then that'll be my final mold. So, anywho, there's a little bit going, and there we go. So these are my new molds. And, um... Yeah, the hardest part is getting them fish laid in and the fins, you know, looking good. That's that's pretty stressful, but um, any hooba, there you go. Thanks for watching.